the 1995 Ulster Grand Prix of the Dundrod Circuit in Northern Ireland. It's the 66th time that the bikes have come to race for the Ulster Trophy, and the Lisbon Borough Council 250-400 race starts off the day's sport. The revs fly up to nearly 12,000 on Richardson's bike. Number 10, New Richardson, comes from Gloucester, we're away with him. As away they go on this twisting, curving circuit here, the surface of which is always something which can cause a few problems for riders, particularly on tyre wear. Richardson about eighth or ninth place here. And lots of revs as they go off down the straight. Loses himself a place that looked to me as if Gavin Lee came through. And in the lead, Joey Dunlop, 43 years old, determined to go well here. And Dunlop really at the moment holding off Dennis McKellar. Because if he wants to keep it that way, a flash there as Richardson goes through in number 10. You can see where he is in the pack. There's number 11, Kate Parkinson from Lancaster. And here's Richardson trying to make a place. Got himself slightly offline there in order to get through. Came out on the wide line. Rank that bike over and takes himself up there. A place, that's the place in fact that he lost at the start as they come down here with the marshals waiting for them. Still, it's Dunlop, but he's now being pressured by McCulloch, the Banbridge rider, really giving it all he's got in an effort to try and unseat the occupant of first place. Not literally, of course, as we go back to Richardson again, trying to make another place here. Threatening at the moment to take away Alan Coffey's place. 